Welcome to the Account Solutions. Our concept is to help young accountants and business owners to get their records right. I'll be showing you how to use the Petty Cash Template one to maintain a simple Petty Cash. If you go to our website on www.theaccountsolutions.com, you get to our free template page. You will download this Petty Cash Template one. When you download this Excel file, this page will appear just to give you some uh, little warning. Always enable content, also enable for editing and the rest of the instructions here. Now, to get to the help page to assist you or guide you through the sheets, we have the user interface, we have the tables, we have the account chart, petty cash book and the ledgers. This is how you will use this particular template. Most of the things I've written down here will be shown to you in this video. You go to Nest and you set up your company details. First of all, I'll pick the company's name, ABC International Limited. Location, let's say Port Harcourt. Calendar year, just pick one year, 2017. Current user, I'll just put Ben Jamin. Okay, you can just ignore currency. Now you get to next. Here you will see that I have already set up some account names and account codes. Now, if you don't like these codes, you just um, highlight all of them and just press your debit. That will be all. Okay. Now you now set up your account code, account name, and your account subclass. The subclass is to enable you to classify the accounts into various um, headings. Okay, ensure that the account names match with the account subclass. Once this is done, you go to your account chart table and select the account names. There are two things. What you are doing here is to right, set up the account code and names you want to use in the business. After here, you have to now bring them out to enable you use them for your petty cash. You come to the next page, you see I already have some account names I've brought out. Let's say we don't want all this. We just um, bring them out, delete them. We don't want them, okay? Delete them. Now here you have to select the account names you have set up in the tables. So go back to modify table and key in the account names that I want to use and assign various codes to them. Let's assume we have our account names and codes and account subclass set up somewhere. We just bring them into this template. I just copy from somewhere and I just paste here. If I have my account codes, account name and account subclass all in here. Now you go to next. So when you come to this table where you select your account you want to use, you will see that they are already selected and if, if you don't like this account just highlight everything here and you just press your delete now everything will be off so you now come here and select the account you want to use now if you have set up this account in the table just come here and select computer equipment the code will come out and the account subclass will come out don't bother about account class and report and account report it is not part of this template one you come back here you select furniture and fittings you want to use them for your um, account transaction posting and transactions validate them here let's assume we have all these ready we just come here and um, bring out all of them from the table now you can see the account code is out and the account subclass is out what we need with this we are good to go next we now move to the petty cash book itself where we record the transactions now let me explain this sheet for you this sheet is very simple and easy to use we have the date the ref the ref will be your voucher numbers receipt numbers invoice numbers we have the details 
explaining what transactions was carried out. Name of party just shows who is the party involved, either the name of the vendor or customer or the staff that made the transaction. Now entry type, we have cash in, cash out, what we call debit and credit. Now for every sales you make, cash sales you make is cash in. For every cash you receive from the bank as impress is cash in. From every cash you receive from the director or from any source into the petty cash is called cash in. Now cash out is any cash you spend on any item, transport, bidding and the rest of them is cash out. Now the account name, these are the names you have selected in your account chart. You just come here and select the account heading that transactions was um, incurred and you type in the amount here without you have done your transaction. So let's assume you have an opening balance. From the first day you want to start using this system, you need to key in your opening balance. So assume the opening balance as of today is 50,000. Now with this, you are good to go. You will now start to enter your transactions in here. When we come back in the part two of these tutorials, I will show you how to enter the transactions and how to add more account names. Thank you very much and God bless you for watching.